Hello everyone, my name is Amrit Pal and I am a student of Griffiths University. Today I am going to share one of the biggest problems which pre uh, present era is facing is the hiring of wrong employees. Under the pressure, the HR used to conduct uh, interviews and used to hire a wrong person. This is the real life experience I had seen in India in my company that the company had hired a wrong cashier. He was not with a commerce background and he was not with the knowledge of accounting principles and standards. Because of that, the company has to pay many big losses. The biggest loss the company has to pay is the lack and the shortage of his goodwill. The goodwill of the company ruined after the incidents happened. What was the case is that the company has hired a wrong employee as the company is in need of the urgent employee for the daily workings. In the pressure, the HR has hired a wrong employee. He was with the not with the commerce background. He has deposited the entire cash of two companies in the one company's account as in the presumption that the employee of the companies are same. Ultimately, the profit will goes to the one hand, which is wrong. As per the accounting standards, the cash belongs to the particular company has to be deposited in the particular company. Because of his error or omission, the company has to pay many big penalties as well. The problems which were faced by the companies are the company has to pay the double salary to the both the employees, to the new one and to the current so that the current employee can train him well. The wrong deposit of the cash has ultimately prepared the wrong financial data. The data reported by the company at the end of the financial year was wrong with the overvaluing in the cash and which ultimately affected the balance sheet of the company. As the more cash was deposited, the company has to pay more income tax than actual one. The later on company got one court notice from the side of income tax department in which there is the query to provide the justification against the cash deposited as the cash amount was higher than the number of sales. The company at that spot had do not have any clarification against the mistake done by his staff which ultimately affected the goodwill of the company. The competitor took advantage of this and they had raised it and make it a big issue in the public market. Because of their lack of clarification and wrong presentation of the financial data, the company has to pay big penalties. I had discussed this problem with two of the most trusted person. One of them was the CA of the same company in which the wrong employee was hired. And the solutions given by him were really mesmerized. He had supposed that there should be the proper job description advertised in while hiring any new employee. And there should be proper interviews to be conducted by the managers of the department instead of the HR only so that the managers are known with the job descriptions, with the roles and duties to be performed by the new employee. After hiring a new employee, there should be proper commercial training given to all the employees so that the new employees can be aware of their working and the ultimate effect and impact of their workings. There should be proper supervision for the initial few months on the work done by the new employee on the daily basis as the new employee has to submit their daily working to their reporting managers. One of the most nice advice the solution was the company should give the incentives and bonus plans to all the employees against their work done. As with this, all the employees will work to their best possible manner and this will ultimately reduce the chances of errors and omissions in the working. There should be proper checklist 
for the license and the study transcripts of the newly hired employees so that the company can trust the new employees that they have this good education knowledge about their roles. Thank you.